On the 6th of February, our team performed four rescues in a very tense situation due to the threatening and unpredictable behavior of Libyan Coast Guard's vessel all day long. They intercepted at least three boats in distress in front of our eyes and approached dangerously the Ocean Viking and the distress boats many times, causing panic and endangering the lives of the shipwrecked persons. At the end of the day, we had a visual on three boats in distress. We managed to rescue two of them in full communication and transparency with Italian and Libyan authorities. We couldn't rescue the last one due to conflicting instructions of the Libyan Coast Guard vessels on scene. Eventually, a Libyan patrol vessel approached Ocean Viking at less than 100 meters and aggressively requested Ocean Viking to leave the scene over VHF radio. In fear of a new security incident and endangering the lives of our crew and of the survivors on board, we had no other choice but to leave the area and leave behind us the boat in distress with the shipwrecked persons on board. I am extremely concerned about this chaotic situation in international waters. In less than 12 hours, we witnessed severe human rights violation. All the frightening encounters we've experienced with Libyan Coast Guard vessels these past years put in jeopardy the overall feeling of safety on board Ocean Viking. Let me remind that we are a civil humanitarian organization filling the deadly gap left by states. We are saving lives in imminent danger of death at sea. Disembarking survivors in a place of safety is a legal obligation. And Libya is not a place of safety.